Hi friends, welcome to my channel Gohan's Construction. Today we are going to see the transformation of old cinema lobby which is refurbished now. Uh, the old demolished image is this one and the new refurbished design is this one. So we will look into it in detail about the column, how it is done. So this channel is mainly to discuss about the civil and interior execution and how it is getting executed. Even if you have any doubts of different kind of finishes, you can share the pictures and you can ask me how it is getting executed. Please do like, share and subscribe my channel to support me further. Before uh, we get into the video, I would like to say that this particular uh, content is made in Tamil as well as uh, in Hindi also. So whoever uh, prefers uh, those language, uh, they can go to my channel and uh, watch uh, those uh, content. I am Subramanian. I have 15 years of experience in civil and interior. So whatever the doubts you get uh, in interior as well as civil, you can comment uh, to my channel so that I can revert to it. Now get into the video. Here mainly we are going to look about this column. See when we start the column, so the design is circular design but the structure is not circular. So this is like we have to make a shell of it. So once the circular column we found that we will take a periphery of it and we will take a, a template of it and we will do this kind of intermediate support to strengthen the column. This kind of wrapping with a thin plywood will be wrapped over it and the space between each bay is meant for a cove lighting which you have seen in the first image. So that is the reason we have made uh, such gaps. So you can see the intermediate uh, column supports wherever we have taken it to get this round circular we have given given enough support like uh, L support and uh, all the necessary supports for it to get it more stubborn and now if you see it so it is done almost till the ceiling level so once we have uh, get into the ceiling level then we will look into the ceiling wherever the services lines all are made it as per the as per the drawing and uh, as per the site condition so you can see it how it is done now the basic shell part is done almost and now the flooring is also uh, to be taken care so flooring if you see the flooring level we have made a four inch of uh, gap which is meant for us cutting usually we give for the cutting because whenever we do a wet cleaning that should not impact the surface that is why we are giving a cutting of four inches whichever we can finish it either ss or marble or granite whichever the way and now you can see the flooring which has done a cuttings also as per the design pattern see this pattern is we have we have to transfer the design in the floor and we have to make the cutting each and every cutting to be very precise and once that cutting is done we have to take those granite and we have to install a new one as per the pattern so when we remove it and refix it there will be n number of damages will ha happen if the workmanship is not done properly and secondly you can see it it is done and it has cleaned thoroughly because uh, we have to recheck it whether the design and our uh, execution is uh, same or any uh, minor errors while execution now we are seeing about the ceiling this particular area we have planned to go for a wooden ceiling so wooden ceiling is made with a MDF so all the leveling has taken care once the leveling is done they have done the installation of a MDF ceiling with a slope it is a slope ceiling we can call it as and secondly the laminate finish so this wooden ceiling is get end with a laminate finish so you can see that it is started with a vertical finish so once we have completed the vertical area lamination and then we are going to install it to the bottom area so while installing this laminate we will have to be very sure that there is uh, no bubbles going to happen here because uh, whenever we install it at the bottom uh, getting chances of bubbles is more because as this is uh, installed in bottom due to gravitational so uh, the bubble started coming in a, a couple of hours or in a day time so once the bubble comes if suppose we have to rectify it i'll tell you how it get uh, to be rectified if uh, you are interested to know it you can comment it so that i can uh, detail it in my next video so now you can see it that entire bay is done uh, fully laminated and uh, properly sticked it so once it is done we can go to the next level so you can see it now everywhere the lamination is going on 
after that the lighting part so wherever the cove area we have given so those areas already we would have completed the wiring so those areas we have done the lighting so the led strips comes in 5 meter length and uh, if required it can be to 10 meter 15 meter also so here we have used a 5 meters here you might have get doubt why this led strips getting installed at this stage i'll tell you why because later stage we cannot install it because the korean which we are going to install it after this one which will overlap the ply may uh, around uh, 10 to 15 mm so at that time you cannot insert your finger easily to install the uh, those led strips that is why we have uh, made it uh, at this stage so now we will see the ceiling area ceiling area when it comes to the gypsum ceiling those areas we have a cove finish those this is that cove finish where we have uh, made a round uh, level of periphery of 200 mm so with that the cove finish is getting happen once it is done the ceiling will get closed now we will see the solid surface which i told you as korean in layman language call it as korean so this is a korean finish we could say that so the as this is a round surface the korean comes in a straight sheet so once it delivered so we will take it and cut it as per the bay dimension and then we throw a fire using this cylinder you can see it so once we will throw a uh, minimal fire on it it will get to a bending stage so once it come to that particular stage we will lift it and wrap it over that column particular column whichever the column we wanted to get finished here you can see that uh, clampings also we will lift it and uh, keep it around align with that around uh, periphery of that uh, particular column and later stage we will clamp it uh, over it so once this clamping done and it has got uh, ready we will take it again and we will uh, install it uh, with the adhesive concern adhesive we will apply those adhesive and we will stick over it and we will clamp it again and let it for around uh, 24 hours time so once it is done the final stage is polishing so the polishing will make that entire area dust so those dust need to be cleaned very properly and now you could see that the image which i shown you at the very beginning almost we have reached a partial area up to that stage so this refurbishment has done in two stages like first off will be at uh, uh, the project stage and the second off will be at late with the operation side so once this uh, first off is done so we will take uh, the second off after handing over this first off now you could see that entire column how it looked like with the skirting ceiling level finish everything as i told you that skirting hope you understand and you remember that the skirting is required why because when we do a wet cleaning that that is very much required and this is a close-up uh, image of that uh, bay joints where you could uh, couldn't see that uh, plywood also as i said that it will get overlap now the cleaning very deep cleaning is going on like uh, each and every nook and corners everything with a professional team so this is how we execute uh, the projects hope uh, you might have a good idea about how the things are getting executed uh, now you could see the final finish of it here might you might have several doubts like how the ceiling has happened how the wall finish has happened how this kind of furniture has done if you have those doubts please comment uh, so that i can make a new video of it also hope you like the video thanks for your uh, time please do like share subscribe and motivate me to uh, upload this kind of uh, videos uh, further thanks for watching Bye. Have a great day.